I would make the case that the most important thing that happens for an oil company is the ops team keeping the well in zone. Um, you know, really the, the, the entire fate of the company relies on that. And no, I couldn't agree with you more like the geo steering and it's a new, it's relatively new. We've been doing it for a while, but now the data is really starting to stack. You know, in places, you know, the Permian Basin in particular, right? They're just lined up, stacked up and down, tightly spaced. Um, Oklahoma here, you know, we don't have quite the, you know, type of spacing uh, liberty that a lot of other plays do, but we've certainly started to stack the amount of data that we have. And, you know, and I've said this this before and with a few of the other people I've visited with, but here in Oklahoma, we have a bunch of legacy vertical operators that are now kind of willingly or not a part of the horizontal plays. And they're still holding acreage and working interests and all these things in these wells. And um, they have technical teams and, and people that have dealt with their, their production in the past, but sometimes the new horizontal drilling is somewhat of a new wave for these people. And, you know, say they may have a geologist there just loading their surveys into Petra and kind of guessing what it looks like. And so, what I would like to do for these types of people, and I hope that there's you know a market for it, is to be able to come in and take their non-operated uh, horizontal wells that they've got the data for, re-steer them, run analytics on it, and allow them to make better choices going forward 